in the heart of Boston, an anti-Trump protest on Boston Common. Hundreds of people are taking part. It's been peaceful so far, but police are on guard. Let's get right to WBZ's Ken McLeod, who's live there in the middle of it. Ken? Paula, this is a demonstration that began to take shape on social media last night, even before Donald Trump was officially named the president-elect. You can see him walking out here on Beacon Street right now. This got underway just about an hour ago. He's not my president. I would never follow or uh, admire or look up to someone that's all about hate. Never. And never, he'll never be my president. Well, as I was trying to say, this started on the steps of the State House at about 7 o'clock, and then this gang you see behind me walked down and onto the common. Uh, they're here to uh, protest Donald Trump and his election, obviously. Uh, they told me they were shocked and angered by his election. Uh, they, obviously, uh, they, uh, their demands are things like uh, no border wall in Mexico, uh, no deportation of undocumented immigrants, and that sort of thing. Right now, they've been circling the common, uh, and we understand they might make a stop at Copley Square before this wraps up in just about an hour. It's not all aimed at Donald Trump. Uh, we've heard quite a few negative things about Hillary Clinton, and we're having to be awfully careful out here because there's uh, a lot of uh, vulgar signs and nasty language. For now, reporting live from the State House, Ken McLeod, WBZ News. And we professionally avoided all that.